Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sir Dinger and welcome back to The Sims where we are literally carrying on from where we left off about three minutes ago. <laughs> oh well. But yes, it's raining, it's pouring, there is no old man yet. Actually, that's a point. How far are they? They are not, they are the 19 days. So basically, Marek will turn into an adult maybe two days, hmm, let me think. Ooh. I think teenagers have a lifespan of 15 days. So, Marek has two more days until he's a teenager and then 15 days. Yeah, Marek will turn into an adult two days before before uh, Rex and Deborah turn into elder, elderly people. Right. I was about to say, you need to really, Charlie needs uh, seven friends. No, you just need the one. All right, after you're finished with that, there's a mirror here. Go and practice your romance because you want to be sexy, yeah? Uh, increase your ego. That's what I am unable to do because I hate myself. Right. Well, you finished your homework. Good. I hate homework with that, like with the, the biggest passion. It's just, it, to me, it's completely useless. All it does is increase the stress of your students. If you're a teacher and you're watching this, take note. All homework does, unless the person is asked, explicitly asking for homework, all it does is stress out students. But there we go. Right. Messaging. So the question is what are we gonna do today? We've got eight grand in the in the bag. I would enjoy it if we earned a bit more every day. Or just earned a bit more in general. And I'm not sure how to do that. Don't be dicks to each other. I, w I wish there was some way to ink right. First of all, Jackie bloody stinks. Second of all, I wish there was some way I could uh I could increase the friendship level between a dog and another dog. Oh right, you're taking okay. Well you'll 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 be fully recharged in the morning. One of you pissed on the floor. Right, um scores for praise for not chewing on the furniture. There, you can stop now. Well you could have stopped earlier, it's just <laughs> Did he just say woof to kind of try and persuade him? You're playing Razzle, yes. I don't even know what is Razzle, please. I just expl I just realized how barren this bloody room is. Like there is nothing in here, but oh well. It's it's good enough for what it it's good enough for its purpose. Especially considering the fact that I have stuff I wish to be doing later on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang up on. Okay. First of all, your homework is still lying there. You're supposed to get help from Ryan because Ryan wants to help you with your homework. Stop reading. No. Stop. Listen to your master. I am your god now, okay? That uh, better be the last bit of homework. Good. Good. Now I won't have to destroy you in another life. I've been read I've been uh, listening to a lot of gaming creepy past us recently because I kind of prefer people reading them because then I can sort of play games whilst not focusing entirely on them. You're going to not wash Jackie. In fact, what what's going to happen is a uh, Ryan will wash Jackie. No, don't read to anyone. Everyone's got to go to bloody places. Good. 
please say Jackie actually doesn't have work today, otherwise I'm going to have to... She has work, she has work, except it starts at... Alright, it starts at 9. Okay, I can get... I can be a bit more lenient. Someone's enjoying food. Right, you will clean all of this up as this is your duty as a robot. Don't eat the belief off food. Clean up the food. Before it, like, eats some robot and sim alive. <laughs> I guess it's assimilation. Ha! Alright. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I am so, so sorry. Except I'm not sorry at all. Alright. You need to go to work, and you will do so after your bath. How's your hygiene? Yes, you will be fine. Right, there we go, that's alright. Down you go. Look at the kind of direct go. What, what? what are you complaining at? She was behind you! Right. What's Deborah doing? Oh. Okay. I wanna answer that phone. Also, Ryan's now late for work. Brilliant. Good job, Ryan, you pillock. No. Alright, bills, yay. Oh god, I hate bills. Just spent ages as well, uh, basically planning out, um, oh, you got an achievement. Not achievement, but your want completed. Good, I'm so glad. I've, uh, I've just sorted out my student finance yesterday as well, and it was one of the most painful experiences I think I've ever had in life. And I've decided I am not looking forward to uni as a result. Because as all maybe like an enticing experience that I should look forward to, I don't see the point in bloody sitting there being all like, hey, yeah, take all my money, I've signed my soul over to you. <sighs> I mean, I'll, I'm, I'll maybe enjoy it, it's just right now it's sort of, it's there and it's just pissing me off with its existence. To kind of be bluntly frank. If that's even, no, it's not even a term. But how can a robot not have maximum body skill? It's a robot. What does it matter? Hmm. The class is a substitute teacher a day and the teacher decides to let Charlie pick the game. Which should Charlie pick? Uh, dodgeball. Dodgeball's more fun. Yeah. There we go. Oh, for God's sake. At the end of a lunch break of poker, a dog playing poker, which is admittedly a portrait, Jackie and the rest of the dogs from the set of Spot, Beat, Spot Beats the Odds decide this will be the last hand. Patches McWaggy, the star of the movie, says the final hand should be double or nothing. None of the other dogs bite into the deal, so Patch Patches calls out his understudy Jackie and says that if he could, if she can beat him, she can do she can do his stunts for him. However, if Jackie loses, she must fetch Patches' newspaper for a month. It's a big risk with both huge and humiliating payoffs. So basically, I either get demoted or promoted. Right. Not a fan of those who basically bit bit Wait, what she got sacked for not playing poker? 
That's ridiculous. She, she got demoted, okay. At least she got demoted and not full on sacked, which was ridiculous. That's like saying, oh, this individual didn't risk losing money, so as a result, I'm going to make them lose their job and demote them to a lower class. What? This game, it's at times, just it pisses me off. It doesn't make any sense. It's just... Yeah, you're getting A+. Plus. Good. Good for you. I don't care. Right. Uh, yes, you're fine. Just do your homework. I don't care. Opal Adams. Can I join her? Yes, I can join Opal. Okay. After you finish your homework. Do I have work today? No, I don't. So that's okay. Alright, okay. Where's Opal gone? Oh, she's eating. Oh, that's generally making me wretch. That, that's why would you do that? They're literally off so much. There's bit, there's flies flying around them, and you're eating it. What's wrong with you? That's disgusting. Who's winning this? Let's find out. Well, hey, Marek, is Ryan available to talk? Uh, no. I don't understand that. Like, also, that's an interesting thing. Deborah is a vicious bitch. <laughs> I wish I was joking. I really wish I was joking. We were, we were, um, I was on the lot playing with, I don't know who it was. I think, it, I think I was using, uh, Leona, I think, the romance sim. And things just went down. No, it was, uh, just, it was Tom. It was Tom Burdock as well, actually. And for some reason, she just started a fight. And she began just basically bullying everyone. Like, she literally ran into his apartment, slapped him in the face a couple of times and ran away. Why? Like, people start fights for no apparent reason. I'm starting to think Deborah might be racist. It's... It's not acceptable. It's not It's not on. I mean, the same Deborah, obviously, not the actual Deborah. As that would not be fair. Oh, this robot wishes to, uh... Join... Watch! Just watch. You can, uh... Gain some social. Are you gaining social from this? Yeah, good. Okay. Right, actually, that's a thing you can do. Play poker. Can you play poker? Yes, you can. And, right, uh. Ask to join. You're gonna have fun. The question is who's gonna win? Oh my god, I know Vin's got. Oh god, here we go, we've got a full-on poker duel. That, that's not really a duel, it's a poker standoff more. Let's see who wins. We'll go for five more hands and see if we've made profit or loss. That's a fairly high stake. Someone has been stealing treats from the inventory at Biscuits and Treats, the local gourmet dog food establishment. Leroy and his partner, the contraband sniffer Buster, have been ordered to guard the store to prevent further theft. Later, late in the shift, both dogs detect a faint odour coming from the back of the store, and Buster leaves to investigate with his highly trained nose. After a long period of time, there is no sign of Buster and Leroy is beginning to worry. Should Leroy keep waiting for Buster to return, or is it time to look for him? I don't know. Because if we wait, then he's going to turn back and then he might t come back. But if we don't go looking for him, then... Wait. 
Ah, oh, damn it. Unbeknownst to Leroy, Buster manages to corner the culprits, a pair of wily skunks, in the act of stealing an assortment of treats. Unfortunately, Buster lacks the muscles of Leroy, and the two skunks make off. Okay. Basically, both dogs have gotten a demotion. I just thought, can I actually... I can't, like, give them things to make it so that's more likely. Right. Okay. Right, so, uh, the robot has won. Alright. You two can just keep on playing. I don't, I don't, I'm not bothered. Right, um. You got to answer the phone. Is Rex 78 available to talk? Yes, he is. I don't know why I want to talk to Rex 78, but okay. Maybe your workmate. I don't know. Right, um. Why is it so much that? Okay. Uh, let me guess, you're sleeping. Yeah, I bloody knew it. Right, well, what's going to happen is you're going to do your homework. Uh, then you're going to take a shower. And, uh. Rex 78. Who is playing poker right now? We'll stop playing poker. We'll go and answer the phone. We'll serve turkey, because why not? Um, let me guess. She's asleep. Yep. Right. Well, you can get your ass out of bed, mate. Yeah, you can keep on playing poker. You'll get your social up. No, what, what are you doing? Let me guess, you just want to relax. Okay. Right. Okay, okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. So, Rex 78. No. After all that, that was it. That was all it was. Okay. Right. Okay, what's gonna happen? Uh, right, right. Rex is making breakfast. Or dinner, even not breakfast. It's bloody 11 in the n at night. It's not breakfast. It's more like midnight snack. In dinner form. Right, okay. Right, okay. One plate. Uh, you will not join. You will go and eat. You will not join. You will go and eat. You are dishing it out, so it doesn't matter. You're probably playing, yes. You will clean that up. And then you will eat. You. After your shower, will eat. Rex78 can go and eat, I'm not bothered. Right, and then after you've all eaten, you can, uh, you will go to bed. You, guess what you're going to do? You're going to go to bed. You are not going to go to bed because you're a robot. Um, you will uh, eat. You will then use the toilet, take a shower, and then go to bed. You will eat and then go to bed. So basically, Ryan, hang on, what's wrong with Jackie? Uh, bladder. Okay, she's got to go pee. Good, she's peeing outside at least. You will, uh, clean. Praise for peeing outside. Uh, and then, not bother, because that's just going to be telling someone what they can do. Right, okay. After eating, you will go and recharge. How are you stuck? Oh my god, how? You can just walk behind the chair. Oh my god, right, okay, hang on. I'm going to have to do this because she's an idiot. Apparently. There we go, right. And put that back, okay. And presto, you can leave now. This game. In terms of movement, at least, it's inferior to The Sims 3. Yeah. <laughs>
Yeah, sure, go and eat. I'm not bothered. Then you can go and recharge. Like that we've just had him in formal this entire time, like not in his not even in his uh typical outfit. Did he just say Cookie Man? Yes, Cookie Man, the greatest hero of our time. Right, you're going to sleep. What about you, Mr. Ryan? What are you going to do? In fact, you know what? You're not going to do any of that. You're going to clean and fill the bowl, and then you'll clean and fill the bowl. And then you'll go and give Leroy a bath. I didn't realise Leroy was that bad on uh, food. And then after after you've given Leroy a bath, you will go and recharge. I thought you were going to go to the toilet, take a shower, and then go to sleep. That was the idea. At least. And then we can end off the episode. <laughs> Leave! Thank you! Christ, no one is listening to me today. Then you're gonna go to sleep. Wait, did he just gain weight? There's a robot gaining weight now? Okay, I'll go with it. No, you're not going to, you're going to wait for him to finish having a shower. No, I said nay. You will run here as punishment. And then you shall go and clean that and then wash Leroy. Uh, and then you'll go and... <sighs> They're being so loud, why? And then you can, not auto lights, you can go and recha recharge. Why isn't he just doing one thing? Right. After you've got, right, get Leroy. Go on and get him. Right after after he's washed it, after he's washed the bleed dog. Come on, you stink. You gotta go take a bath. Right, and then you can clean, and then recharge. Wait, are you kidding? Please say he's actually gained hygiene because of that. You, why? He's ignoring everything I'm saying and just doing like one tiny little wash. Right. There. After you've washed the dog. Scold for escaping from the bath. Okay. Go and recharge, I'm not bothered. Right, I'd like to thank you all for watching. My name has been Sitting. Uh, leave a like if you're enjoying the series. Subscribe to become a true say and keep up to date with everything that I post. <sighs> right, good day, and I'll see you next time.